my name is Jayla G. It's been a minute. It's been a hot minute since I last made a video and I apologize for that. I was just, I got caught up with trying to wrap up my, you know, my semester, my freshman year with exams and trying to make sure I am a semester with good grades and stuff. Um, but we getting back into the routine of things and making videos and stuff. Um, but for this video, I'm going to show you guys me preparing me packing for my trip to Houston. Yes, I'm going to Houston. Um, I'm going to Houston with my boyfriend and his family, and I'm excited. This is my first trip of 2024. We leave next Friday, May 10th. It is currently, today is Thursday, May 2nd. Yeah, Thursday, May 2nd. So just give you a rundown of how this video is going to go. Tomorrow for my appointments, I have my wax appointment, I have my eyebrow, and I have my, um, yeah, that appointment. If you know, you know, okay? So I have that at 12.15, and then I have my pedicure at my salon at 2 o'clock. And that's it for tomorrow. I'm going to pack on Saturday. Uh, I'm probably, like, if you follow me on Snapchat or Instagram, I'm probably going to do a poll on what to pack. Because we're only going down there for about, what, two, three days. So I don't have to pack much, but I want to have options so, like, I can pick what I want to wear while I'm down there just in case we have a change of plans. So I'm going to pack on Saturday. And then I have my hair appointment on Tuesday. Um, if you were, if you follow me on Instagram, I did a poll, I think like last month, so I'm going to get Fulani braids. Um, so I'm getting that Tuesday at 6 p.m. And then Wednesday, I'm getting my nail appointment. I'm getting my nails done with Kayla um, at noon. And then, yeah, that's it for all my appointments. And then Thursday, I believe, yeah, Thursday I have work. And so I'm just going to pack like the last minute things and then I leave Friday. Our flight is at one o'clock. So I'm going to probably, I'm still going to leave for like at seven or eight o'clock in the morning because of traffic on the way to the airport. You know, I live in Timbuktu and we live forever away from everywhere. So might as well just leave as early as we can and i'll be there for a couple hours and then i'll be in houston i'm so excited i'm so excited so um that's enough of me rambling before we actually get into this video make sure you like comment and subscribe and turn on post notifications so you're notified every time i post a video i'm back in the i'm back in the group of things we're gonna start i'm gonna start making more consistent videos every week okay um but yeah this is just a preparation video i'm gonna take you guys along with me to all my appointments and what I'm doing and all that. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. See you later. Good morning guys. It is Friday, May 3rd. It is currently 9.19 a.m. Um, I've been up about like since about seven. Like I said yesterday, my appointment, my wax appointment is at 12.15 today and my pedicure is at 2 p.m. And the wax place is literally about like seven minutes away from me. Um, so I'm going to leave about like 12, 12. Um, I know I said I was going to pack on sat, well, literally tomorrow, but I might as well get it out the way. I have nothing else to do. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to show you guys me packing. I okay, y'all. So this is me editing the video. Uh, that yeah no the rest of that clip me rambling literally so my phone case had like a little chain on it on the back of it so every time i moved the phone it like the chain kept hitting the back of my phone case it was very loud and annoying and it happened throughout the whole rest of the clip like i know you guys probably heard it like quite a few times like in the past few other clips but i just decided to take that out but other than i'm just rambling talking about my appointment and all that literally i just get into telling you guys what i'm going to pack and then me actually showing you guys me packing so yeah you guys didn't miss anything okay guys so i did have to stock up like i had to get some things for the trip and i'm 
I think I still need to go to Ulta again today. Um, I ran out of my Soap and Glory face wash, but when I went to Ulta, I couldn't find it. So I got the La Roche Posay Purifying Foaming Cleanser because I'm totally out of cleanser. So I got this. Um, I got some eye patches for like a couple days before the trip and then also during the flight. And then my mom got me some more toner because I also ran out of that. And then I also had to get a new makeup bag because the one that I had was really, really nasty. Like, it was really dirty. And also the zipper broke, so I got this little pink one. Um, So I'm going to figure out what I'm going to be packing, like what I'm bringing. I definitely want to bring, like, two dresses, two, like, sundresses and two swimsuits. And then probably, I don't know. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Let me, I'll figure it out and I'll show you guys. Okay guys, I'm back. My bed looks a mess now because I was struggling to figure out what to bring. But I was saying to myself, I literally have no clothes. And I kind of don't, like I have a lot of clothes, but like, I don't know. I think it's just me. I think I just don't know how to style my clothes. Like, I don't know, like, I don't know. I, I was really struggling. But, uh, yeah, I, I don't know. So, as of right now, we have this green dress from Shein. We have, we're packing that. And then we have this white dress from Windsor. So those are my two dresses and I'm bringing two swimsuits. I'm bringing this blue set. Yeah, girl, we can see that. And I'm bringing this red bandana set. And then I'm just bringing like these white polka dot girl, shorts. Girl, be for real. And pairing it with this white uh, shirt. And then, um, I'm going to, wait, hold up. I'm going to wear, I'm going to bring these boyfriend jeans and then pair it with this yellow, what the heck? This yellow bodysuit and this yellow bandana that has like dogs on it. And then... I'm gonna bring these shorts. Those are from Shein. With um, I'm gonna pair those with this a regular black bodysuit and this black, gray, and gold bandana. And then I have this shirt from Shein that says "Love Never Fails," and I'm gonna pair those with my this brown biker shorts. They're getting washed right now. Um, and then I'm just going to bring an extra pair of jeans. And then um, I'm going to pack like, just in case we do go ATV riding, I'm going to pack like some black, probably like, I don't have black biker shorts. You might go to the store and get that too. Black biker shorts or leggings and just a regular black shirt, which I have in here. Let me grab that. This this black shirt and then probably I'll probably do like the biker shorts because it's gonna be hot. Um and then um I'm gonna pack like some regular like a pajama set, which I can't find. Um I'm gonna just pack this um, blue pajama set, shorts, and a top. 
have my neck pillow. Um, the day I'm going to the airport, I don't know if I want to wear like a sweatsuit because it's going to be cold going to the airport. And it'd be cold on the plane. I get cold easily. So I think I might just wear this green sweatsuit the day of um, my flight there and back. And then as far as like my shoes to go with all these fits. Y'all, I don't know. I don't know how to style. I guess I, that's just my, my dilemma because I have a lot of clothes, but I don't have a specific style. Like, I have a lot of dresses. I have a lot of blouses. But, like, as far as, like, regular, like, casual wear or, like, street wear, I have nothing. Um, like, like, I literally don't know. Like, I'm trying, I'm looking at my shoes and I literally don't know. I'll be right back. Let me look at my shoes and I'll be right back. Okay, guys. Yeah, we have another dilemma. I literally have no shoes to match with these outfits. I have a few options. But I just, I really feel like I need to just expand. Expand my wardrobe because this is insane. Okay, so for like these washed out shorts, the bodysuit, and the bandana, I think I might just wear these slides I got from Shein. That's gonna have to be the best fit. But if I don't like, no, no I'm just gonna probably do that. And then, um, when we go, if we go ATV reading, I'll just have my black Converse. I don't mind those getting messed up. And then, I'm out of breath. And then I got these messed up fake Birkenstock from from Forever 21. Like, look at the back. They're all peeling. I'm probably going to go get some more today. After my nail appointment. I'm a, After my pedicure today, I'm just going to go, like, probably to a cartridge. And see what I can find. For as far as shoes. Clothes, I'll worry about another time. Because I am going to Atlanta next month in June. But... Y'all, I literally don't know. Like, I don't have no... Like, I have... Bro. This is kind of sad. Like, I don't know what I'm gonna wear with this. And I don't even know what to wear with these dresses, bro. This is crazy. Well, with the green one, I can wear some Birkenstocks or whatever. The white one... I'll probably just wear the silver. And then this outfit, I don't know. Okay, whatever. Um, I'll figure that out another time. I feel like I'm saying that like I got time. I think those are really my only options. I have a lot of flip flops, but I'm not walking around in flip flops. Like, no. Like, I don't got no ear, like, I don't have no. Jordans or nothing like that's what I really want. I need like a collection of Jordans, but we don't got no space in this closet because I share a room, I share a closet, so <laughs> don't got space for all my stuff. So we're gonna figure that out. But in the meantime, I'm gonna pack it as 1014. I'm leaving at 12. I still haven't eaten I still haven't eaten breakfast. Um, but I need to do that because I plan on taking a Tylenol be like at eleven forty five before my appointment, so it's not as painful. But let's go ahead and pack what we already have and go from there.
Okay, guys. Everything's packed uh, that I can pack right now. So all my clothes, all the outfits are packed, swimsuits and stuff, undergarments, shoes, socks, and then um, like the new skincare that I bought because I'm I still have some of my old skincare so I can use that for home. So I have like Q-tips and um, cotton rounds and stuff, my perfumes, my body wash, makeup remover. Um, I have to figure out which lotion I'm gonna bring. I'll figure that out later. Um, but like the night before or the day of, I'll pack like toothbrush, toothpaste. Um, no, been a few hours, but it felt like days. Um, only been days, but it felt like months. We gone for a year, only go like once. Life move fast when you do what you want. go in here I did get I did have to buy some new concealer so I have the milk hydro grip primer and then I have the Fenty Beauty skin tint in shade 17 and then for my concealer I still have my old Fenty concealer it's the pro filter one but the new one I just got is the hydrating long wear concealer in shade 350c um i have some powder blush um by mac the whitney houston one and then i have the liquid blush by rare beauty i just have some mini moisturizer and then i have some brow gel my setting spray the one size BB cream. I do not like this. I don't like it at all. Um, I have some bra um, some lip liner, some more blush, and some highlight. Um, and then I, I just cleaned my setting brushes. I meant to say makeup brushes. Yesterday or the day before, one of those. So I'm letting they're still drying, so I'm gonna let that dry. And then, other than that, oh, I have my setting powders in there. I gotta put them in here. But um, I'll pack this on sun the makeup on Sunday. I also have to get my hair braided, y'all. I've been looking like a hobo with my hair for a long time. Um, but other than that, that's all I can pack for now. I already have my outfit. I'm just gonna wear the green sweatsuit for the airport. Um, and as far as like a purse, I think I might just bring my the only purse I'll bring is my black Michael Kors purse. Um, it's it's a nice size purse. Um, so I can just carry that around while I'm out of town. Um and that's it for now. It is currently 10:37. So I still have a lot of time before um I get ready to go. I'm going to shower again before my appointment. Take my medicine, well eat. Shower, take medicine and just you know prep my skin and stuff and then we can be out of here yeah so i think i might see if i can just stop at partridge creek and like go to like probably forever 21 i need some new shoes like i need some shoes and i could see if i can find some black biker shorts because i can just wear that for atb ray um, and then I also have to go to Ulta to get some new beauty blenders because my one beauty blender has been through it no matter how many times I've washed that, that, that thing. Um, it's got, you know, nail marks in it. It's ripping and stuff. So I'm like, let me just get some new ones. So I'm going to go there. Um, 
um after my nail my pedicure at 2 p.m <sighs> yep so i'm just bringing this suitcase and then i'm bringing my backpack for my electronics on my ipad my computer my chargers and all that and then um that's pretty much it guys i'm gonna make sure i bring my handy dandy neck pillow i haven't been flying in a minute wow it's been a minute but yeah that's it guys for now um I'll check back in with you guys before my wax appointment. And then, yeah, well, I'll just take you throughout the rest of my day preparing for my Houston trip. All right, bye. Okay, guys, so it is 11.55. I'm about to leave in, like, a few minutes. I just got off the shower. I did my skincare. I look like a grease ball. I don't care. Um, I just realized when I was in the shower, I didn't shave my legs embarrassing but um it's uh, anyway um i don't have tylenol but i have motrin <sighs> people were saying to take tylenol specifically because i think i don't know if it was ibuprofen or motrin that was like a blood thinner so it's gonna hurt worse <sighs> so all i have is motrin so we're just gonna take a motrin um i'm gonna drink some water i'm gonna tie up like fix my hair a little bit and then i'm out of here and then yeah i'll try to see if i can record the process of me like getting my eyebrows and stuff done but we'll see if i'm allowed to record other than that i'll see you guys at the waxing pot that's what it's called the waxing pot all right bye hey guys i'm here it's 12 10 my point's at 12 15 i'm about to go in right now it's a little it's a little, i'm a little nervous i'm a little nervous not gonna lie that's the building the waxing pot it's raining yeah raining um so i'm about to go in i'm gonna see if i can record but if not, I'm just gonna tell you guys my experience. Wish me luck. Okay, bye. Okay, guys, I'm here. I'm in the here's the little room. This is the waxing studio. She's gonna do my eyebrows first, and then we gonna get into the other one, the other waxing. So I'm gonna see if I can record. Um, but yeah, she seems pretty nice. She seems very comforting because I was like, I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous. My eyebrows, I'm not, I'm not scared about, but the other one, yes, I am. But yeah, I'm going to see if I can record. But if not, you guys will see the final results of my eyebrows. The other side, and then I will be wiping them down. Okay. And after that, I'm going to detail them out. Okay.
Almost done. Okay, I'm going to have you take a peek at them. Okay. Here's the mirror. Okay, yes. I like it. You like them? Mm-hmm. Yes. I'm going to get these fuzzies out my face. <laughs> so, my eyebrows are done. They're a little thin for my liking. Like, they're not going to be like that. That's okay. That's okay. She did good, though. I think her name is Christine. Christina, so but she did good. Now I'm gonna be ready for the other the other waxing. Okay. Um so yeah, I'm gonna prepare for that. Hey guys, me me again editing the video. Um it's a I I was gonna record my reactions and stuff for me getting waxed and stuff, but I was like that's unnecessary. Y'all get my y'all get my overall experience and reading of it like when everything is done, I did not show that part because that's just unnecessary. So, yeah. Okay, guys. Um, I'm at my nail, put my pedicure right now. About to go in. It is one like one forty seven right now. My appointment's at two. About to go in, but I just want to tell you guys about my waxing experience. I don't have any words right now. I'm glad I did it. Don't get me wrong. I'm glad I did it. But man, that hurts so bad. It hurts so, 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 so bad. I was sweating so much, you guys. You, you probably noticed I changed my top. I was sweating so bad. I sweated, you know, like the the paper like that's on the bed, like at the doctor's appointment. That's what she had on like the table or the bed at the wax appointment. I sweated through that whole thing. Oh my goodness, it hurts so bad, but I'm glad I did it. I'm glad I did it. And my eyebrows, they look, like I said, they look decent. Um, So the eyebrows and the other one was 90, which isn't bad. She did, a, she did a very good job, very good job. And I was not in there very long. But I'm about to go in to my pedicure i'm so tired y'all i'm about to go into my pedicure get these toes done and then we're gonna go to partridge and then we're gonna be done for the day okay bye Hey guys, I'm out of my pedicure. I love my nails. I just got blue French tips. And yeah, that was it. <laughs> um, got a little massage in. And I needed that massage because I can feel the knots in my back and it was hurting real bad. But I'm at Partridge Creek right now. I'm about to grab a few things um, from Forever 21 that I mentioned to you guys earlier. And yeah, that's about it. All right, see ya. All right guys, I'm back home finally it's like four. Oh, it's five o'clock five o'clock okay um i left my nail appointment it was like three o'clock i literally got i was in and out within an hour for my pedicure um and then i went to uh forever 21 at partridge and i got me my boyfriend is well, days, but it feel like months. Um, 
I grabbed the wrong size. These are extra large. Oopsies. I was wondering why they look so big. Oh, he going. Oh, he about to be mad at me. And I got him these pants, these shorts, they striped. And then I got him these like tribal print ones. And then some regular black shorts. And then some khaki shorts. So all he needs to get is like some shirts. But um, he probably gonna be mad at me. He gotta take these back somewhere. These are extra large. Whoopsies. But they say that's I grabbed it because they say large right here, but I ain't checked to see the inside. Cause my phone had died. Literally in the middle of me like FaceTiming him to see what he wanted and stuff, and I still have it was so much going on, so I had to wait for my phone to charge and all a bunch of other stuff. So that's why I got home so late. But, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm pretty much set for the trip now. I know I said I was going to go to Ulta to get some more beauty bunders, but I'm actually, I'll just, I'll be fine. Really, that's all I need. Like, the, the clothes and the shoes is all I needed. I ain't buying nothing else because I still got to get my hair done. And I still got to get my nails redone. And then I also want to have money for the trip, like, while we're out of town. Just in case I do want to buy something or, like, get food or something. So, that's that. I'm exhausted. But, all right, y'all, that's if. Oh. Hey there. But that's it for today. Thanks for tuning in and coming to my appointments with me for moral support. Um, I will see you guys Tuesday for my hair appointment. Bye. Hey guys, I'm back. It's Monday, May 6th, 4 o'clock. I just got off work. Um, That's why I look a little rough right now but trip is four days away um i did have to get some more last minute things um so i just got some i went to the dollar store and went to the travel section i got some toothbrush covers um a mini deodorant and then i also got like another like i just got a travel toothbrush two little bottles of mouthwash and i also got um some like more like travel size toothpaste and then um yeah that's about it i'm gonna pack that up i'm going to pack uh, i'm going to pack my makeup bag up because i know i don't need it for the rest of this week i don't also i'm about to pack all this stuff up my hair appointment's tomorrow at 6 after work. So guess what I gotta do today? I gotta wash this hair. I already am... I already had to leave work early because I had a terrible headache. So, it is 4 o'clock right now. I'm going to take a little power nap. And then I'm going to do my hair. I might record me doing my hair. might not um we'll see but if i don't then i'll just show you guys me getting my hair done tomorrow and then wednesday i get my nails done and then friday's the trip 
so yeah um if i don't see you guys later on today i'll see you guys tomorrow all right bye okay guys um it is tuesday it's about it's 5 20 right now i'm about to head to my appointment i'm gonna get there a little bit early it was at six o'clock it's 5 20 update on last night i did do my hair it's washed blow dried took me a little under three hours did i want to cry yes did i want to rip my hair out yes but we got through it so um yeah so i'm gonna show the process of me getting my hair done okay bye Update, it is 8.14. It's almost been about three hours. We're still working on the top. We still got a long way to go. But I'm gonna do another check-in later. Just know I'm extremely tired. I'm ready to close my eyes. My eyes feel like they're about to pop out of my socket. And I'm hungry. But other than that, let's get back to the braiding. Hey guys, hair is done. I just got home. It is one o'clock in the morning. But it's okay. It is it is late. I love my hair. Yes, I love it. Book with Alexis. When it's been a few hours, when it's been a few days. I'll, I'll link her information in the description box below. She's the best braider, hands down. Yes, I'm really liking these jerseys. Oh my gosh. Bro, I need to, bro. It's like they're, bro, she did her thing. That just is late, okay? I just hope I can redo them like that. So, but I'm very, 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 very pleased with this hair. Um, But yeah, I'm going to go to bed because I have a nail appointment at noon today, technically. But I'm days, but it feels like months. And then that'll be it for preparation, guys. And it's going to be soon. I really like this hairstyle, bro. It got like the little flip braids for it. Hold up. Hold up. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Y'all, I'm so tight. I can't do it right now because my head hurts so bad. It's so tight. But it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's my tan feminist hairstyle book with Alexis. Um, I'm going to go to bed now because I have been up since 7 a.m. Um, gonna try to get some sleep and then get ready for our nail appointment because these five of them fell off and they are badly outgrown. I don't know if you can, yeah, you can tell they're very bad. But um, I'm gonna post, not post, but I'm gonna show a picture of the inspiration that I have and then yeah I'll see you guys well technically later on today all right bye hey guys nails are done Kayla did an amazing job I will make sure her information is down below. Thank you, Kayla, for getting me right for this trip. <laughs> I'm about to go home, wash these armpits, and go to sleep because the girl got work in the morning. All right, y'all. Hey, guys. So, just like 9.30 at night. It's, it's still... um. Wednesday as I said earlier I'm going to wax my underarms you guys probably see this on my nose I forgot to mention it earlier <laughs> during my nail appointment <laughs> but my clever self decided to pop
pop a blackhead last night and I woke up with it and my trip is in a day. And makeup won't cover it, so if y'all have any tips, let me know. Stuff came out and I'm like, okay, I'm set. Woke up. I woke up with this on my nose, so. Right. What happens here? Anywho, anywho. Anywho, uh, Sienna's gonna help me wax my underarms. Cause it, it, yeah, I feel like it hurts even more to do it myself, so I'm just gonna have her do it. So let me. Only been days, but it feel like months. Hey y'all, it's me. I'm back. Um, this is me editing the video. Okay, so <laughs> I was supposed to insert the clip. It's like a 23 long, like raw clip of me and Sienna waxing my armpits, but CapCut didn't want to import the video into the import the clip into the video, and then I tried to go into Photos to shorten the clip, and then Photos wants to give me problems. I just need a new phone. I need a camera. Like a vlogging camera. Ugh, guys, this video is a hot mess. It's a hot mess. I'm sorry, y'all, but... I'm so sorry. This video was a hot mess. It's a lot of... Child. But yeah, y'all can't see me. almost crying from waxing my armpits. But just know it hurt. Okay? It hurt. Um, But y'all yeah, really ain't missing nothing. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I guess. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get better eventually at making YouTube videos. Give me some tips down below as far as editing and like recording ideas and stuff. So yeah, that's the end of this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and stay tuned for the vlog. Love you. Bye.